Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel. This is Cynthia of Cynthia Plans and today I'm planning the week of November 11th through November 17th. Um, first and foremost, I just want to apologize if my voice sounds a little bit rough at all during this video. I am a little sick. I um, actually have some tea over to the side here to kind of help me get through this plan with me. Um, I thought about just not doing the video at all, but I, I feel well enough to do the video. Um, so I decided that I would. I just hope that it's not um, rough for any of you guys to sit through. Um, so with that, let's go ahead and stop worrying about talking too much and just get started. So to start, I have a kit from Jackson Pepper this week. It's called O Fall, and it's a photography kit. It's been a little while since I've done a photography kit. Um, most of the kits the last several weeks have all been um, just little uh, graphics and doodles and stuff like that. So, um, and even back in October, I think that was probably true. It's really, it's really been a long time since I've, yeah. It's all been mostly artwork, clip art, doodles, all that sort of stuff. So it's kind of nice to switch it up. It's a little bit strange um, to be doing a kit that's not so fall, but I kind of like that. Um, it's a little bit of a different vibe. Um, I did pull out some of my more neutral, oop, washi going everywhere. Um, my more neutral, simply gilded washi options to pull out for this kit. And I've got them all here to just um, plug in as I decide. And I'll keep those off to the side for now. Um, these are the full boxes as part of the kit, and then she's got some like event label size stickers here. There's some um, really neutral, these probably almost look white even to a degree, washi strips, um, some bow headers, and then just some washi, washi event size stickers um, with the uh, photos from the uh, full box part. Um, we've got some headers in her um, serif font that is... Um, Pretty, I would say recognizable for her as well as a hand lettered script font for some other stickers some half boxes here some event labels bow checklist day covers some more of those um, hand lettered labels here icons hand lettered stickers a weekend sticker and um, all of that some full boxes with the bows um, a weekly sticker, a hydration tracker, some different um, event size labels for TV, meal planning, etc. Um, habit trackers, and so on. So it's a comprehensive kit as always with her. Um, I want to say I got this one on a $2 Tuesday special, but I can't remember anymore. It's been a really long time since I purchased it, um, but I'm really excited to use it and go back to one of her kits. She has really, really high quality stickers. Um, I will link her shop in the description below. Um, I don't have a PR code or anything like that for her. I just really, really like her kits and her stickers. Um, I know I mentioned a while back, um, one of my, I think probably the first kit I used in this, um, neutral hourly planner was from her, was this, um, photography kit, but the foiling on her stickers are also probably the best foiling I've come across in the entire planner community. So, um, I definitely highly recommend using her stickers. Um, I, I used another week from her. Maybe it was in August. Um, yeah, this one too. She just got really, really nice stickers. So I definitely recommend it. Um, anyway, I'm gonna stop that soapbox moment and get started. The date covers are down. I'm gonna go ahead and cover this up. So here I'm going to be putting um, my workouts for the week. I have not been super great about uh, working out lately. The last couple of weeks, months um, have been really hard on my schedule and my energy levels, so um, I have not been making the time to work out like I normally do, but my uh, coach, um, I do youth speech body products, um, my coach is running a group right now where we are going through 21 day fix um, real time, so um, we started it last week, it didn't start off great because as usual, my schedule was bananas, so um, 
I think I only got one workout of the seven done last week, which is pathetic, but I'm just gonna regroup and get back to it um, this week and hopefully get the program done. It was supposed to be taking us up to um, Thanksgiving as a group, but obviously I'm a week behind now, so my schedule is going to end up being a little bit different now. I'm keeping that there to help keep myself accountable um, by writing it down, and hopefully things will stay on track. I'm going to use meal plan stickers here so I can block out that time. Um, I think the biggest struggle is when making time to work out is not having evening commitments, which I really try my hardest not to do, but it doesn't always happen that way. And then being able to leave work on time is the other thing that really makes a huge difference as to whether or not I'm able to be successful with my workouts. Um, so I want to say I don't have anything in the evening this week, and it's a godsend. I do have my AC meal planner and I'm gonna grab that so I can see what I have planned. I didn't get the meal plan for the weekend done um, when I did my meal plan. Um, this time last week, I didn't want to go that far out because I didn't know what the weekend was going to hold, so I kept that blank. I'm assuming there's This Is Us this Tuesday. I have no freaking clue at this point. I'm like two weeks behind, so regardless, even if there is not an episode on television during that hour, I should probably try and catch up. Um, if you do watch This Is Us and you happen to know whether or not there is an episode on Tuesday night. This will be published Tuesday morning, hopefully. Um, if you know before Tuesday night if there's an episode or not, please let me know. Um, I've got payday on Thursday. I'm doing things a little out of order from how I normally do them, which is probably a little bit odd. It's odd for me right now, but this is just what it feels right. I have two doctor's appointments this week. The seasonal surprise box also comes out on Monday. So put the link for that. I was looking for these because my husband just started a new job seasonally, I think I've already mentioned it, so I um, actually don't know what his schedule is except for days of the week right now, so after this video I'll find out from him and put this in, but for now I'm just going to put these little boxes down and that's where I'll put his schedule. because I'm not going to put washi there, I'm just going to white out these little bullet point type things because they don't need to be there. Since I have an appointment on Monday, I'm not going to put a Coffee Monday sticker there like I normally would. Instead, I will just put it wrong sheet. No, right sheet, just wrong part of the sheet. Oh, actually, there's a coffee sticker. I can put that there as Coffee Monday. I'm drinking a mint tea, which is really soothing to my throat right now, so it feels really good. So I decided to do something a little bit different here than I normally do most weeks. Um, I'm including, of course, my bow checklist like I normally do most Saturdays, but I'm also just doing Sunday together um, because we will have um, 
a lot of stuff to do next weekend. I wanted to start decorating my house for Christmas this past weekend, or at least like cleaning and prepping it, but with not feeling so well, I decided to just listen to my body and rest and um, instead, pardon me, um, I'm going to be preparing my house for the holidays um, next weekend instead. I am hosting Thanksgiving and I usually like to have my house decorated for Christmas for Thanksgiving because um, the chances that um, I'll have a lot of guests or family members coming over again before Christmas um, is pretty slim if I'm hosting Thanksgiving. So um, for me, my decorations are of course for myself. My birthday is two days before Christmas. I absolutely love Christmas. Um, really wouldn't need that as a reason to decorate but having other people be able to enjoy them is definitely a motivating factor for me to get them done before Thanksgiving so um, yeah next weekend we're gonna get that started um, because the likelihood I will get it done all in one weekend is pretty slim but if I can get the bulk of it done next weekend and then finish it off the following weekend before Thanksgiving um, I should still be in good shape. All of that is in um, my content planner just reminded me that there is an occasion on Wednesday so I kind of need to figure out how I'm gonna mark that here because I didn't really kind of forgot about that so I don't have as much space maybe I can pull this up so it's World Kindness Day on um, Wednesday tomorrow after this video publishes and so um, I have a little something fun on Instagram I'm gonna be doing for that if you don't follow me on Instagram I have um, my handle linked in the description and um, you should give me a follow to see what we what I have planned all right so content meals are in um, put that there's probably not probably definitely a football game on Sunday so I should put that in here Again, the sticker is from the Smush Peach. I've been using it um, all season, so um, I highly, obviously, recommend her stickers. I also have a PR code for her um, if you are interested. It is in the description below. I'm just checking the weather really quick. Um, things are getting a little interesting with the weather. I think. Okay, so Wednesday is supposed to be um, pretty chilly, so I'm gonna grab another sticker from the Smush Peach, this Emmy one with like a little pumpkin spice latte and a scarf, um, so I can make sure here that I prepare um, accordingly and don't wear something that I'm gonna regret. So for a lot of people that probably seems super mild, um, but that's cold for us here in Florida. Um, so I'm definitely going to have to make sure that I prepare accordingly, um, make sure I dress my son a little bit more warm than I normally would on that day. So, okay. So anything else? I do have a bunch of different personal things to do for SSP and other things, but I don't think I'm going to put those in here. I think I'm going to just put them in my hourly, um, or in my hourly. It is kind of like an hourly, but my petite planner um, is what I will do instead with that. I'm going to just stick these bows in here, only because I don't really want them to go to waste. They're really pretty. Last thing I'll do is put when my videos are publishing in here. I think there may be a bonus video that comes out this week, so just keep an eye out on that. If you turn on notifications, obviously you will find out, um, but I'm not sure when I'll have time to publish it just yet. So for now, um, it's just going to be a surprise. Okay, we can move all 
all of that out of the way. And I'm gonna put some washi in. And I'm kind of tempted. Oh, I'm gonna hold on for a second. Okay, never mind. I thought I had black. Simply gilded washi with black bows, but somehow I have not acquired that yet, and that just seems like a really huge oversight on my part. Um, I feel like I don't want to put washi in this spread. And I don't know how to feel about that. <laughs> um, I just feel like I'm happy with what's here. And I don't really feel like I need to add any. I pulled this, but I don't think that's going to go. And from what I currently have in my SG collection, um, I don't feel like any of it goes super well. I feel like I could add this, but I don't feel like it's adding anything to the spread. I think it's nice and simplistic and fine the way that it is right now so um, yeah I think I'm gonna do something a little a little controversial right now and <laughs> not do washi in this spread um, and call this one done so besides the fact that I've chosen not to do washi <laughs> if you have questions about any of the stickers that I have in here or remarks that I made or anything like that, please feel free to ask me in the comments. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up. And, um, you know, like I said, I'm gonna be publishing a secret video probably at some point, surprise video this week. So if you subscribe and turn on notifications, you'll be one of the first people to find out. So with that, I'm gonna call this one done and I will see you back next week for yet another plan with me. Have a lovely day.